Well, this one precedes a very special story. So, in order to give you the added context of this next story in the countdown, I will be giving you this one. Lavender Town Syndrome. The Lavender Town Syndrome also known as the Lavender Town Tone, or the Lavender Town Suicides, was a peak in suicides and illness of children between the ages of 7 to 12 shortly after the release of Pokemon Red and Green in Japan, back in February of 1996. Rumors say that these suicides and illnesses only occurred after the children playing the game reached Lavender Town, whose theme music had extremely high frequencies. That studies showed that only children and young teens could hear, since their ears were more sensitive. Due to the lavender tone, at least 200 children supposedly committed suicide, and many more developed illnesses and afflictions. The children who committed suicide usually did so by hanging or jumping from heights. Those who did not act irrationally complained of severe headaches after listening to Lavender Town's theme. Although Lavender Town now sounds differently depending on the game, this mass hysteria was caused by the first Pokemon game released. After this incident, the programmers had fixed Lavender Town's theme music to be at a lower frequency, and since children were no longer affected by it, that was that. One video appeared in 2010 using special software to analyze the audio of Lavender Town's music. When played, the software created images of the unknown near the end of the audio. This raised a controversy, since the unknown didn't appear until Generation 2 games Silver, Gold, and Crystal. The unknown translate to... Leave. Now. 